Oh, right. Alright, cool. There goes two. Oh god, I got knocked down. How dare you hit me with a spiky stick. Dick. Ah, oh, balls. I mean, no, that stuff's just crap. Star. I can't star. Well, I guess I'm keeping them for the time being. It don't matter. It's not like they weigh much. They all have such crappy stuff, though. <laughs> like a weapon that does 60 to 100 damage. Whoa! Where I currently have a weapon that does... Well, it, its range is between 3 and, like, 600. But the damage it actually does is well over 2,000. So, yeah, fun. Oh, there's this guy as well. Is there another guy? Oh, God. That was a pretty sinister laugh. Yeah. Closed. Ooh, ooh. The helmet of wisdom. It's worse. How? What the fuck? I hate these ones. Because they're so crap. Look at that crap. <laughs> what is this? Whoa. Aldebert's teeth. No, like, just... I don't like armor that has limitations or penalties for using. It's like wearing this, you can't use two weapons, you can't swim, you can't use a bow, you can't do anything. <laughs> Jesus. Just let me take all. Oh my god. The inventory system in this game sucks. Well, it doesn't. It's just stupid at some points. Alright, so we dealt with them. So, there's that. There's the other gate. Now we can go up to the bandit camp. I keep calling it a bandit camp when it's a bandit cave, more than anything. And this is where I need to remember to spare the guy called Finch. Don't kill him. You can just spare him and say you killed him, and you still get rewarded. The game's kind of dumb, but whatever. It's their, their limitations. They don't say, like, bring me their head as proof of your deed. It's just like, you know, just go to this place and kill the guy. You don't even have to kill the guy. You just have to say you did. There we go. It's both of them. What's it called? What is it you get off of the... The the dragons or wivens? Wivens? I don't know how you say it. I think it's like the lacrimental gland, isn't it? Or something like that. It is... Lacrim lacrimal. Not mental. Lacrimal gland. I told you, you won't get in without a password. The house greets Finch and sends the payment. Yes. That yes. Took a while. Go on in. Finch awaits you. Good. Yes. Yes. <laughs> That's not like you said, ish. Yes. Awesome. Minerals are alchemy ingredients that are needed to create bombs and weapon enchantments. <laughs> hmm. I smell food. I think someone's Love cooking bacon. Things. Oh, not good when you're hungry. <laughs> and recording. It's just like, mmm, food. Especially when it's bacon. Bacon is the best food. It actually is one of the best foods, I think. Right, here's Finch. Don't talk to me, I want to fully explore the cave. And the cave is fully explored. Finch, wait a sec. There we go. Finch, tell me of your deeds, good man. And I'm not going to kill you this you're time. Late. Again. Again. If Seth thinks I'm one of his slaves, he better think again. Wow. Where's the money? There is no money. Only <gasps> a farewell from Set. Oh my god! Damn their eyes. <clears throat> Why are our employers so hasty? Is it because of the little incident? <laughs> I can explain that. <clears throat> explain. Convincingly. It Pretty. Wasn't our idea. Someone contacted us when we were getting supplies in Gorolin about a week ago. He asked us to steal something from the excavations transport. At first we thought it was a jest. You know what work we do for Skeldon. He must have known it too, but he didn't seem to care that we wouldn't let him go with that knowledge. Hmm. Warren wanted to kill him then and there, but he said, cool as you like, I can arrange for certain people in Catalan to vanish. That man knew how to grab our attention. Do you have any problems in Catalan? 
I thought Set might have told you. A sweet little wench whined too much. Turned out her father was of great import in the city. We had to leave sudden-like. Oh. Mr. <coughs> Horn went to Talmont and joined up with the rest. We stayed there boozing for a while till Set found us and locked us all up. Boozing. We were sure we would swing, but we didn't. Lucky. So he offered you work? Aye. We were supposed to attack the caravans and store the booty here. Said it always sent his men to take it from us. <laughs> but the pay was regular and was much safer than facing up to enraged fathers of the wenches we'd got to know. Uh -huh. Then, three weeks ago, we got no money. Then again. And that meant Set didn't care about us anymore. So we left as fast as we could run. Mm. Then the stranger arrived. I got my stomach. It was simple too. We take a special item to Four Stones. He makes a big angry father vanish and opens up Catalan for us again. What was the item you were to bring to him? Worthless old dwarven junk, if you ask me. Who would do so much for an old piece of rubbish? I don't care. I believe that man can do anything. He can. What do you mean? Because <clears throat> they say now that the Giritza has competition. And twas that stranger. The family tried hard to catch him, but he got away. Fled. You understand? He got away from the Giritza in Goralin. He can do anything. Ah, enough babbling. You didn't come here to listen to my stories, did you? Set wouldn't send a bad fighter to us. And? You'll may have kill a few of us, but we'll get you, and you know it. Right, now here's where I messed up. Like last time, I said you talk too much, can you use that sword you carry? But what you say, or what you're supposed to say, is this. No one has to die, give me the item you spoke of and leave. I will tell Set that he does not need... Ah, oh, that he does not need to worry about you now. So basically what we're saying is, give me the item, so I can give it to Keshi, and I'll go and tell Set you're dead. Interesting. That's mayhap not the best proposal I've heard lately, but... Interesting. Why would you do this for us? I need to know a few things, and your booty may be worth much more than your lives. Here, keep it. It brought us nothing but trouble, and I'm sure that stranger in Four Stones won't care who he gets it from. I think that the climate in Talmont is getting unhealthy for us. With the Orc War underway, there's good chances for the <coughs> likes of us. Farewell. Alright, see you, dude. Yay, I got a skill point. Oh, yeah. Uh, what did I put it in? I think I put it in to stealth. Alright, cool. Following the shadow. Oh, that changed. It changed from... in The sh shadows of the family, or whatever it's called, to following the shadow. It does, interesting. Yeah. By the way... So we need to go back to Keshi in order to give him the artifact. What does it look like? Oh, is that it? That shield? Really? A dwarven contraption? Yeah. Interesting. Although the thing is, what you could have done is taken the artifact and then killed him. So you could have literally done both. But, eh, can't be bothered <laughs> to do both. Well, there's no point, because even though I do do that, it should still be fine, it might still screw something up, so I'd rather not. Unless I know it's fine to kill someone, I won't kill them. <laughs> oh well. So I'm quite, ha I'm quite happy that I had the, the setback of, like, the hour wasted, because it means I've done things much better and much quicker than I did before, because last time, or when I tried to record, I... it wasn't necessarily bad, it's just I was running around an awful lot and just talking to people I didn't need to talk to, and trying to complete quests which I'd already done. So yeah, it was a, a, bit, of a, a bit of a mess. Oh, oh. News, mercenary. <laughs> uh, aye, here's what you wanted. Huh? This thing? What does it do? It doesn't even work. It's a shield. Are you disappointed? Nay, but tis a surprise. Strange indeed. Anyway, you have accomplished your task. I'll tell my superiors of this. Before I forget, you said information and money's what you need. Here, 
This'll help, perchance. <laughs> you got to wherever you go, friend. What? And I got reputation with Giritsa. Yes. I also leveled up. Blub, 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 blub. Uh, I'm level 25. Yes. Alchemy is maxed. Woo. Fucking hell yes. Uh, okay. Where? Where do I need to go for that? Wait, what? That quest is gone. It seems. Traitor in the house. Disposable tools. I've done. Oh, following the shadow. There we go. Oh, Jesus. Where the hell's this? What the fuck? Where is that? What? Oh my god, that is far away. Holy crap. Oh, that's talking to Ho. That's so far away. That's st four stones. I know I said that rather poorly. Four stones. Bloody hell. How the fuck do I get over there? Dela Delatkul Gre Glacier. Oh, interesting. I mean, there's that village, but I don't think I can go east. Like, that's into the mountains. That must be a possibility of getting there, because otherwise it wouldn't be on the map now, would it? Right, so now we have reputation with the Giritsa. We've got good reputation with the Giritsa. Which means... I can now enter Gorilin. Which means... I can complete some of the excavation stuff. Which means... I can... Probably finish the... The war between Karga Clan and House Skeldon. Hopefully. The way I'm going to do it is probably kill Ibra Skeldon, because the Karga Clan seem to be more valuable assets. And hopefully, in doing so, I don't get completely screwed. Which could happen. Ah, oh, I thought that was, like, permanent. Damn it. It could screw things up, so before I do assassinate Skeldon, I'll make sure I save. Because... That's the last thing I want to deal with, is to completely fuck up something. But that's why I'm doing all the excavation stuff first. So then I'm not completely screwing myself over. So then if I do everything that's in the excavations, I don't need to worry about... You know, not being able to finish a quest because I killed the person that gave me the quest. Because that's my biggest worry, or was my biggest worry. That's why I'm doing it a bit smarter. Tis you. They told me to let you in if you came here. Hey, good. Who told you? They. This is a Giritsa stronghold, friend. What did you expect, the Royal Council? Do nothing foolish here. Our eyes are everywhere. Oh, okay. Boom. Yes. Right, there are quests I need to do here. One I got from the excavation. Fucking hell, that food. It smells so good. Ah, oh, excavation. Traitor in the house. Who have we got to say? Someone is spying from the house within its own ranks. Oh, I need to find the that person then. And collecting evidence. Contact Zed Masara. So I need to talk to someone called Zed Masara. There we go. Zed. You. Hi. You. What the Zed fuck are you? Masara. Ethan asked me to find you. He cannot come. I know. There must be a skeleton informer here. Con Kronik of the clan barely escaped before they came to his house. Do you not perform the same task for the clan? Mayhap, but I don't care for money. I will help Clan Karga to ruin the plans of Abrat. He will pay for everything. A private grudge, Mayhap? An old grudge, Mayhap, but very much alive. So Ethan sent you for the documents? I have them here. Tell Ethan that these are all I could obtain without arousing the suspicions of Brock. He is so canny, I fear that I could be in trouble for this. You are. You're looking at him. The documents. Proof of the House of Skeldon's dishonesty with their allies in Catalan. It will not suffice to have the king lop off any heads, but mayhap will stir things up. Hmm. Okay. Give me the documents. Keep them. They are a death sentence if you are caught with them. And now I have to kill him, I think. Just in case. Oh god, my stomach. God, it won't shut up. It's just telling me it's hungry. Oh crap. God damn, die already. There we go. Oh god. 
Who is this? Esther Green. Oi, talk. Hmm. He's the only one that cares. Wait, if I like walk out of the village, will this guy care too? Hi. No. But this guy is still coming after me. You keep missing though. Esther. 